Hello, Lakeland families and friends. I am Hugh Beatty, the proud superintendent of Lakeland Regional High School, and I'd like to welcome you to our first ever virtual back to school night. This is normally a time when parents follow their child's schedule, attend classes, meet teachers, and learn all about course requirements and expectations. Sadly, these are not normal times, but we have put together a program that is as close to our traditional back to school night as possible. The beauty of it is that you can get all the information given out at a normal back to school night while sitting in the comfort of your own home. Who knows, this may be a trend for the future. A little information about me for those who don't necessarily know who I am. I've been an educator for 43 years, and I've served as a high school English teacher and coach, curriculum coordinator, vice principal, school principal, as the superintendent in Ringwood for five years before coming to Lakeland in 2015. I am the president of the Passaic County Superintendents Association. I serve on the New Jersey Association of School Administrators, Executive and Legislative Committees, and on the executive board of the Seton Hall University Superintendents Study Council. All this being said, I can honestly say without a doubt that I have never faced a more arduous time in my entire career as I have faced since last March. 2020 has been a very difficult year. However, due to the teamwork, commitment, and ingenuity of our administrative team, faculty, staff members, board of education, local police departments, local boards of health, and other stakeholders, we have been able to open our doors for education, set up distance learning classrooms, and try to reestablish a sense of normalcy for our students. It has been a Herculean task, but we have faced the challenges one day at a time. Our students have been outstanding in accepting the challenges of this very difficult time. They have followed our pandemic protocols, cooperated in every way possible, and have shown a sense of enthusiasm and appreciation at returning to school. As always, I could not be more proud of them. I can say the same for our outstanding faculty and staff members who have gone above and beyond to provide a sense of belonging, a clean and safe school environment, and a quality education for our students, whether in a hybrid or distance learning format. They are and always have been model professionals and masters of their craft. I would like to thank all of you, our Lancer families and friends, for your continued support patience and understanding. Together, everything we do is in the best interests of our children. I hope you enjoy this new back to school night format. Remember, if you ever have any questions or concerns, please feel free to reach out to me via the contact information on our website. Please be safe, stay healthy, and always be positive. Thank you and go Lancers. Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, depending on when you're watching this. My name is Michael Novak, and I'm the Assistant Superintendent of Curriculum and Instruction, while also serving as the Supervisor of Humanities at Lakeland Regional High School. I've had the privilege of serving this community throughout the last 15 years in a variety of different positions. I started in 2005 as Assistant Teacher. I then was fortunate enough to be hired as a Social Studies Teacher. I worked in that position while serving as a club advisor and a two-sport coach until I was lucky enough to move into the administrative realm in 2013. The reason I think it's important to go through my background is to highlight the fact that I've seen continual growth and evolution at Lakeland Regional High School. I'm immensely proud of my time here and the talent of our faculty and staff. That evolution has certainly been on display over the last six months. In this very unique time, we were forced to take a serious look at many of our internal instructional practices and how we're going to be able to include and maintain the integrity of those while complying with the nearly impossible requirements of the New Jersey Department of Education to open. Our faculty and staff rose to that challenge. At a time when many districts were unable to open or were uncommunicative in their plans, the people who work with your children here at Lakeland 
made a com commitment to provide a quality education while exceeding those health and safety standards. As a member of our community, you should know how committed our faculty and staff were in ensuring that we opened in September. Obviously, we had to make some changes. We cannot thank them enough for this and thank you enough for your support. So the question is, what has changed? Over 40 different stakeholders worked collaboratively on a plan to ensure a safe return. Well, we have gone back to a semester schedule. Students take four classes in the fall and four classes in the spring. We obviously did this to eliminate the amount of time students would be changing classes and exposing and exposure. But uh, we also did this for social emotional reasons. After a unique year last year, we wanted to ease the students back to school and the workload that goes with it. Please understand that this is not our first time going with the semester schedule. Our teachers are well versed in this since we operated under one for about 10 years until somewhat recently. Pedagogically, this is something they have worked in before. Does this mean that we're packing all of the content into two semesters and calling it a day? Absolutely not. Our supervisors and teachers have carefully unpacked curriculum to identify essential skills that students need to progress effectively. We have also gone to a red-gray cohort day wherein students are broken into cohorts based on last name. The New Jersey Department of Education has strict guidelines and recommendations for cohorts and class sizes. Our ability to do this has allowed us to hold in-person in class sizes to hover around nine. Many of our teachers have utilized the latest technology to support our students by live streaming their courses and using the Google platform to provide direct instruction. Under our phase one, which is in effect until November 30th, our students participate in synchronous distance learning Wednesdays. Parents still have the right for unconditional requests for their children to go remote at any time. All of our students and staff are required to wear masks at all times. We have eliminated study halls and lunches for additional contact points. Our staff members continually clean throughout the school day with desks being sprayed between classes. We're even able to come up with a system wherein students never sit at the same seat or desk in successive blocks. The list goes on and on and on. At Lakeland, we like to consider ourselves as a community school, meaning that we view our job not just providing a quality education to your learners, but also a safe space in which they can explore and develop their passions, critical thinking skills, and engage in a variety of opportunities to better serve their community. We also like to say that we're a community school because it is our goal to engage the entire community in our mission. We are exceptionally proud of our academic programs, which are led by incredibly talented and dedicated faculty members. Our AP pass rate uh, has continued to trend upwards in the last five years, with over 77% of our students passing the AP exam last year. Given the nature of the virtual world and the AP exam, that is even more impressive. Our New Jersey Student Learning Assessment Scores, formerly the PARC, are consistently among the best in Passaic County and have shown the most growth from 2015 to 2019 of any school in our area. We have a new diversity program at Lakeland, UPAL, spearheaded by Dr. Dave Niedesick, one of the individuals who developed the same advanced college and career programs at the Bergen County Academies. These specialized programs allow our students to do a deep dive into six different fields, ranging from biomedical research to visual arts. Our senior options program, led by Mr. Keith Kelly, allows our students, well, a variety of options. These include dual enrollment, internships, school to work, and senior service, where students can earn high school and college credit for exploring their passions. Our self-contained special education programs are instructed by incredible educators who provide unparalleled support to our learn, core, and step students. Our career-focused students have the ability to enroll in a variety of hands-on and certificated programs through Morris County Votech, Empire, Beauty, and other top-notch programs. We pride ourselves on providing a quality education to all of our students. At Lakeland Regional High School, every student matters. Although this year certainly is unconventional, our teachers and staff members are committed to that mission, providing that quality education to all students and making sure that every student matters. There will be no live presentations tonight for this event. Our teachers have prepared PowerPoints and other presentations to provide information that they would normally provide to you on back to school night. Um, we now ask that you go to your child's different fall content areas within the folders. Uh, this has been posted on our website and emailed directly to you. Click on the content, find the teacher, and then find the course. Please sc scroll through or watch the presentation. If you need any clarification or have any questions, please reach out to your teachers. Thank you again for your time and your support, and we look forward to continuing to partner with you for the rest of our academic year.
All right, Lakeland School community, so I'm going to show you exactly how to get to our uh, back to school night folder. Uh, an email should have been sent to you through our Thrillshare parent notification system, but if it's not, eventually it's going to be right down here. Uh, right now we have it hidden, or as I'm filming this, we have it hidden under test just because we want to test the system. But we'll be on our homepage under news. It will be, excuse me, it will be in this area right here. It'll be the first window that you see. So you'll click on see all news. Eventually it'll say back to school nights information. You'll click on that and then the link will be there. But for right now, I'm gonna go under test. You are going to click on the link, which is going to say back to school night presentations. This is going to take you into our Google folder. And then basically what you're going to do is you are going to define, you're going to find the department in which um, your uh, learners, teachers um, work. So if you know that you have art block one with Ms. Garon, um, you are going to click on art. Then you are going to find Ms. Garon. And then if you know that your learner has ceramics and sculpture, you are going to view Ms. G's PowerPoint presentation. Uh, you can view it by either going through the slides or if you want to see how you would normally see during the course of the presentation, you'll click on present. And that's basically it. And as soon as you're done, you'll exit out. You'll go back to the original screen. You'll click back to school night and then you'll follow along. And that's essentially it.